Hello everyone, welcome to my first ever zero waste vlog. My name is Kat and let's get started. So I don't have a lot of video editing skills yet so this will just kind of be a raw video of me talking through um, some of the first ever swaps that I've made to go zero waste. So what I'm going to focus on is the fact that I just completed my first ever zero waste grocery shopping run. So I'm going to talk about the things that made that possible and I'll ask a question at the end and hopefully somebody will give me some feedback. So what really made my zero waste shopping spree possible was these bags and these are by a brand called Earthwise. Um, they are completely see-through, although they are made out of polyester, so they are not biodegradable, but they are reusable, so for the same amount of plastic you have been using in a disposable way, you can reuse these according to their website up to a thousand times each. So that makes a really big difference, and that was what I used to hold my produce and different bulk items that I bought at my local bulk store, which is called Green Star and is a very excellent place and I'm fortunate enough to have it right down the street from me. And the other swap that made this possible was a company called Burn Dairy and they sell milk in glass jars as opposed to plastic. So you can tell I've already drinking a lot of it, but I'm not sure how it works outside of the states, but it has a 50 cent deposit on it and you can return it right to the grocery store. So those are two swaps that I made and I had an entirely zero waste grocery shopping run, which is a very good start for me and I'm interested to hear about other people and their experiences starting zero waste. Um, you can cut the video right here if you just wanted to hear about the grocery swaps, but I started zero waste because I moved, and you can see my boxes back here, but there is just, I have so many personal belongings, and so I started looking up minimalism, and through that I found the zero waste community because if you're a part of it you kind of realize that somehow minimalism and zero waste are tied together and a lot of people that practice one practice the other. So that was about three weeks ago and I've started making swaps and little decisions and things that really have reduced, I hope, some of my impact on the planet and I'm hoping to reduce it even further. So if you have any ideas besides kind of the basic get a reusable water bottle and things like that, um, I would love to hear it, especially if you have any ideas on being a zero waste pet owner, which I will put a video up in the future talking about the things that I discover that can help with that, such as dog toys or cat toys and food and different things that you can do to help reduce your impact and still be a good owner for your pet. So thank you very much for watching and I will see you soon.